Welcome to Penelope Does It Herself, but before I get on with the trick, I'd just like to shout these dice and throw in random numbers. Like so. One final throw. And then we'll get back to these in a minute. But first I'd just like to shuffle up these cards. Okay, so give them a cut. And a bit of a shuffle. Like so. Now normally you'd ask a spectator to deal some cards out, but I haven't got a spectator, so to make it fair I'm going to shake a random number and I'll deal that amount of cards out. So we've got uh, 6, and 6 which is 12, a 2 which is 14, and another 2 makes 16, so I'm going to deal out 16 cards. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Okay, now we've re reached an intersection in the deck. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to use this card here. And I'm also going to use this card here. Okay, and I'm going to shuffle up this packet. Like so. Now we're going to create a random card. I'm going to use this nine and this diamond. So we're going to create a card, the nine of diamonds. But if we also add up this nine and this eight, we get 17. Now wouldn't it be amazing if the nine of diamonds was in the 17th position in this deck? Now still down and have a look. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, and seventeen. And yes, we've arrived at the nine of diamond. Okay. Now let's just try something else. So if we went, we did it the other way around, and we used the eight and the spade, and we went for the Eight to spades instead. We do add the two numbers together again, which would give us 17. 9 and 8 is 17. So wouldn't it be amazing if the 8 of spades is in the 17th position in this deck? Let's just have a look. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 17 and there it is the eight of spades now i hope you enjoyed that and thank you very much for watching